Good morning, everyone. Welcome to the New York Times Hard Sudoku for Sunday, February 4th, 2024. And unlike a lot of Sundays, I suspect this one may be harder than most. I hope to do better at this than I did at the Wordle, which, uh, no spoilers, and go watch that video. But uh, there's only 22 digits in this one. Not 23, 24, or 25, and I don't see any row, column, or 3 by 3 outline region that had 5 digits in it. So hopefully I'll be able to get some digits early on, and then it should unwind from there, but I guess we'll see. So let's go, shall we? Okay, looking by rows, I can place a 4 in row 2 based on where they are in rows 1 and 3. ones i can place a one in one of two spots in row three one of which is ruled out so i know where one goes in box one and consequently where one goes in box seven switching to columns briefly for a moment if we switch back to row scanning i'm done because one's the only repeat digit in the top three in the middle three rows i can place an eight in one of two spots in row five based on where they are in four and six, and I can place a three exactly in box four because this cell is ruled out due to that three looking down in column three and these two threes pointing in. Okay, and then that. Those two through, actually, okay, so three has to be in one of those two, but this can't be three, so that turns into a three, that turns into a one, yay. Okay, so what do we say? Eight, three, and then I've got nine, one, seven, five. So the bottom three rows, nine, I can place in row seven, and three, I can place in row eight, in one of two spots. But that's all I get. Now, if we look at column scanning, okay, ones, I have all of them. Threes, I have all of them. Nines. I can place a 9 in column 3 based on where they are in 1 and 2. Uh, those two 4s actually force a 4 in one of these two, but this can't be, so that one is. No. No, one of these two. I put it in the wrong box. I saw one of these 4s is in here for some reason. 4 is definitely one of these two. This 4 is in box 1, this 4 is in box 7, so there's only two places in box 4. Okay, if we look at the middle columns, uh, 4, 9, 5, 1, 8, 7, okay, 3 is the only repeat digit here and here. So 3 goes in one of these two. And the rightmost columns, I have nothing. Okay, I'm going to have to do work on the left side of the grid here. So, next phase of scanning. Uh, 1, 3, 4, 6, 8, 9 says I need 2, 5, and 7 to finish out column one. Well, actually, wait a minute. That's That can't be five, that can't be five, so guess what, that's a five. Okay, that's gonna put a five in one of those two based on this five and that one. Let's see, box seven, I can do a lot with. One, three, four, six, seven, nine. I need two, five, and eight. And again, th this is the only place for 8. That's 8, so not both of these two. I don't know anything about where 2 or 5 is in row 8 or 9 to be able to limit things yet. Uh, okay, what else can I do here? Let me see what I can do with row 1. 1, 3, 4, 5, 6 are placed. I need 2, 7, 8, 9. This only gets rid of 8 and 9, but that gets me a 2, 7 pair in the box along with the column which is already filled. 2, 7 in the box is going to give me 6 digits in box 1, namely 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 7. So these are 6, 8, 9. This can't be 8 or 9. That is 6. So this is an 8, 9 pair on the right side of box one. Box two, 
one, three, six, eight, nine. So I need two, four, five, and seven to finish out column. Was that two? I know that's not five, but that's all I get. Okay, these are not one, three, four, seven, eight, nine. Okay, those are from two, five, and six. And that's not five. Well, that's interesting. Okay, so these can't be five, and so five is in one of those two. Four is in one of these two. Well, let's see. If this is five, then that's four. Unfortunately, this could still unwind. Is there a way that this unwinds where this is not four or five? If this wasn't four or five, then this would be two seven. Two seven there would force that to be a six. Two seven would be in these two cells. This would be six. That's four. That's five. Which I think is still possible. So this cell here at the bottom center of box number four is not necessarily either four or five exclusively. I just know that four and five are in those spots. Now, let's see. Oh, I already put an 8 there. Otherwise, I'd be able to put an 8 in row 8. That's irritating. Wait a minute. Okay, uh, those 8s will actually allow me to put an 8 in one of these two. And that. No. Those 8 and those 8. So to put an 8 in one of these two, I can't put 8s in the right boxes today. Okay, um, the um, the um, the um. Okay, column seven, I have four things one, five, six, and eight. Okay, those are from two, three, four, seven, and nine. That's just not four. Neither of these are three. I see seven and nine in its row. That doesn't see anything, though. Okay, that only sees four and nine. This sees ooh, three, seven, and nine. Okay, that gives me a two, four. Well, that's helpful because nothing else can be two, so... That's not two, and that's not two or four, and that's not two. two cells of a triple to go with that. So three, seven, nines reduced to a triple in column seven. Let's see what I, what else can I do? <coughs> hmm. Okay, here, they cannot be three, five, or eight. Now that one sees 4 and 9 by column 7 by box. Uh, that was not helpful. Okay, is this going to do me any good if I go down by column instead? 1, 3, 7, and 8 are out. That one happens to see 4, 5 by... Ooh, both of these see 4, 5 by box. That one also gets rid of 6. Oh, that's irritating. Let's see, here and here and here, to finish out row 8, I take out 4, 6, 8, 9. That sees 3 twice, 5 once. 
That's these three. Okay, that's not helpful. I'm running out of things with a bunch of digits in it. Look, the only other option is to go refill in this row. But then almost anything else has way too many possibilities. Okay, well, I don't know any better course of action other than to refill that in. Take out 3, 5, and 8. This sees 4 and 9. Along with 7. Those see nothing else. As yet. No. What I totally missed was there's absolutely nothing in column 9, and I really want to be able to put something in there. But wait a minute. Okay, 2, 5. Well, it says that can't be 2 or 5. Okay, that gives me 2, 3, 5, 8. In row 7. Those aren't nine, and that's not four, so this is down to those constituent possibilities. These are not one, two, three, five, or eight. No, two, three, five, or eight, so they are one, four, six, seven. And they both could still be nine. Irk. Okay, that was not helpful. Uh, well, 3 and 9 both appear here and here, so that, those are 1, 3, 7, or 9. Okay, so the only odd digit is 5. <coughs> and the even digits, but I can't get rid of much out of those. These <coughs> could be 5, and then 2, 4, 6, 8. Except 8's already in the box. Five has at least four spots, as does six, as does seven. Nine's only got two. Three's only got two. One still has four, so that doesn't help me at all, does it? Okay, these cells, which I haven't filled out yet, are not one, four, or five. Six is definitely one of those spots. Let's see, this is not one, five, or six. So I'm left with that configuration. These are not one, four, or six. I'm left with that configuration, and I don't like that this still has six chances in it. Okay, these are not three, seven, or eight only. And I have to scan by rows and columns here. Okay, these are not four or nine by column logic. Those two aren't one by row logic. These
Okay, how the f Oh. Those can't be 5 by column logic. That's not 9. Uh, 1 still bends, as does 2. Um, okay, these can't be 9. And this can't be 9. Okay, so I put 9... Oh, well, that actually does give me a digit and can w unwind some things. And the reason is, I found out the hard way, this 9 looks up, so it can't be there. This 9 looks in, so these are out. Therefore, there's only two places for a 9 here and here. This can't be 9, that's 7. So that triples unwound. That does some work over here. Uh, that's not 7. Okay, 9 is going to tell me 8, 9 over there. Column 1. Okay, none of these are 8 or 9. So those aren't 8, those aren't 9. It actually tells me that's a 2, so that's 6, which makes that 7. Okay, uh, this 2 is going to make 7, 2. All my 2 7s are not unwind, I think. 2. Let's see, not 2. This is 4 or 7. Okay, 2 is going to make that 5, which makes that 2. No, this can't be 2 or 5. That's a 4. Makes that 7. 2, okay, that's now 6. This 5 makes that 2. That 5. And exactly the situation I postulated, where this was 4 and this was 5. One of those weird possibilities. That now comes out. Okay, I think that unwound the grid. Um, because... Okay, this 2 comes down here. That's a 5. This one now sees 2, 5, 6 by column and 4 by row. So that one's left to be a 9. It can't be anything else. 4 to complete column 6. Uh, that one sees 2 by box 6 and 7 by row, that is a 3. This one must be an 8, which makes that 9. Okay, this is now a 7-8 pair, which means nothing else here can be 7 or 8 in box 3. 2, 6 is going to make that cell a 1. Those two aren't 1. That's not 5. Uh, 1 means this isn't 1. Okay, that's forced to be an 8 because this isn't. <coughs> um, wrong mode. That's not 5. Okay, that can't be 5, that can't be 5, and that can't be 5. So, 5 and column 4, I know where that goes. This isn't 9. Or 4. matter. These aren't 7. That's not 4. That's not 4, and that's not 4, and that's not 4. I know where 4 goes. Column 5. Essentially... Okay, these three cells are a triple. As are these three. That 4 is going to come over. This is 2. That's 4. That completes column 7. Uh, this can't be 2 or 9, so that's a 4, which makes that 3. Row 2 is done. Uh, neither of these are 9. And that's not 3. This is 2, 5. That's the only pair I've got left there. Now, here... Okay, one, two, six, seven. All seen by row. And that one sees four by column, so nine, four. This two's gonna come over here. Six, two, uh, one, six, six, and column four, seven, two. So those triples are unwound. <coughs> okay, these are one and eight. I'm 
excuse me, so 1 and 8 in row 6, that's done. This cell is a 6. Okay. Um, this can't be 9 because of that, so that cell's a 9. This is 4, 6, 7 by row, and... Yeah, so the only thing this could be is a 1. Also by looking at what's left. So 1, 8, 1... Uh, these are at 1 and 5. 2, 7 is going to turn these into a 5, 6 pair, and this cell has a 6 looking at it. So 5, that's bad. And now we're just unwinding. Um, this 8 comes up. 7, 8, 7, 2. Okay, 20 minutes, not bad. I might have had this in 15 if I hadn't seen the pair earlier on. But this is not too shabby.